Welcome to the Drishti IAS to the point program. Our today's topic is respiratory syncytial virus or RSV. First of all, we'll see why this is in news. According to an estimate, respiratory syncytial virus that is RSV was responsible for more than 100,000 deaths in children under 5 worldwide in 2019. RSV is the most common cause of acute lower respiratory infection in young children. Now let's have a look on its key findings. The study is the first to examine RSV disease burden in narrow age brackets. As per 2015 estimates, the number of annual cases of RSV in children up to 5 years old were 3.3 crore. In 2019 too there were 3.3 crore RSV associated acute lower respiratory infection episodes in children under 5 years old This accounts for 2% of annual deaths from any cause in this age range In India according to the report the incidence rate is 53 per 1000 children per year that is 5.3% An approximate 61 lakh 86,500 episodes of RSV associated acute lower respiratory infection in children below 5 years. Globally, only 26% RSV associated deaths occur in a hospital. This is particularly apparent in low and middle income countries. Overall, 97% of RSV deaths in children under 5 occurred in low and middle income countries. Now let's know about respiratory syncytial virus that is RSV. RSV is also called human respiratory syncytial virus or HRSV and human orthopneumovirus. It is a common contagious virus that causes infections of the lungs and respiratory tract. It is a negative sense single stranded RNA virus. Its name is derived from the large cells known as syncytia that form when infected cells fuse. RSV spreads through contact with respiratory droplets, coughing, sneezing, etc. from an infected person. RSV can survive for many hours on hard surfaces such as tables and crib rails. The virus typically lives on soft surfaces such as tissues and hands for shorter amounts of time. Symptoms like influenza, flu or COVID-19. Symptoms of RSV infection usually include runny nose, coughing, sneezing, fever, decreased appetite and wheezing an initial drug called palivizumab an antiviral drug called palivizumab is available to prevent severe rsv illness in high risk infants however the use of palivizumab is limited it does not help cure or treat children already suffering from serious rsv disease and cannot prevent rsv infection now it's time for the practice question Consider the following statements with reference to the respiratory syncytial virus or RSV. Statement 1: It is a negative sense single stranded RNA virus. Statement 2: Like influenza or COVID-19, symptoms of RSV infection include runny nose, coughing, etc. Statement 3: An antiviral drug called palivizumab is available to prevent RSV infection. You have to select the correct statement with the help of the given options and options are A1 and 2 only. B two and three only, C one and three only, or D one two and three. Don't forget to answer in the comment section. That's it for today. Stay tuned for the next session. Till then, Jai Hind. Dear viewers, to watch this topic in Hindi, please visit our Hindi YouTube channel.